Welcome to Premath. In this video, we have got this uh, semicircle with the center O and the triangle uh, ABC put together as you can see in this uh, diagram such that uh, this uh, segment uh, CD is uh, 8 units and moreover the area of this uh, semicircle has been given to us as 18 pi square units. And now our task is to find the value of this uh, side uh, AB. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And here's our very first step. Let's recall the circle uh, theorem. According to this theorem, the angle between the radius uh, and the tangent will always be 90 degrees as you can see in this given uh, diagram. And here we can see this is our radius and this is our tangent line. So no wonder this angle is going to be 90 degrees. So therefore in our case uh, this angle uh, BAC is going to be 90 degrees. Since uh, this is our radius and this is our tangent line. And here's our next step. Let's focus uh, on this uh, semicircle. Let me go ahead and label uh, this radius uh, OC as uh, lowercase uh, r. Likewise this uh, OA is the radius of this very same uh, semicircle. So I'm going to call this one lowercase r as well. And now we are going to calculate the value of this uh, radius r. And since the area of this uh, semicircle has been given to us uh, as uh, 18 pi. And now let's recall the area of a circle formula area equal to pi r square where r is the radius. So therefore the area of the semicircle is going to be pi r square divided by 2 since we are dealing with this uh, semicircle. So therefore I can write uh, pi r square divided by 2 equals to our this uh, given area which is 18 pi and now we can see pi and pi cancels out from both uh, sides so therefore we ended up with the r square divided by 2 equals to 18 now let me go ahead and multiply both sides by 2 to remove uh, this uh, fraction so therefore this 2 and 2 is gone so therefore uh, r square turns out to be 36 let me undo this square by taking a uh, square root on both uh, sides so therefore our radius uh, r turns out to be positive 6 units so therefore our radius r value turns out to be 6 uh, units so therefore this whole uh, length uh, ac is going to be 6 plus 6 uh, is going to be 12 units and here's our next step let me go ahead and connect uh, this point a with this uh, point uh, D. As you can see in this uh, next step I have connected uh, these two points. And now let's recall the Thales uh, theorem. According to this theorem if A, C and D are distinct points on the circle where the line AC is a diameter then the angle uh, ADC is going to be right angle that means uh, it's going to be 90 degrees. And in our case we can see that uh, points A C and uh, D are the distinct points uh, on this uh, semicircle and AC is the diameter. So no wonder this angle uh, ADC is going to be 90 degrees. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this uh, right triangle uh, ADC whose uh, side lengths are uh, 8 and 12. And now we are going to calculate this uh, side length uh, AD. So therefore we are going to apply the Pythagorean theorem on this uh, triangle. And here's our Pythagorean theorem a square plus b square equal to c square. Let me go ahead and call this longest leg uh, as our side c. I'm going to call this unknown side as lowercase a and this side uh, lowercase b. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, Pythagorean formula. So we got uh, a square plus b value is 8 uh, whole square equal to c value is 12 uh, whole square. Let's go ahead and simplify. So a square plus 64 equals to 144. Let's subtract 64 from both sides. This is gone. So therefore 
a square value turns out to be 80. Let's go ahead and undo this square by taking a square root uh, on both uh, sides. And here we can see square and square root undo each other. So therefore a is going to be equal to and now let's focus on this uh, square root of 80. I have just copied it down over here and if we simplify this thing that is going to give us uh, 4 times square root of 5. So therefore our a value turns out to be 4 times uh, square root of uh, 5. So therefore our this uh, a d side length turns out to be 4 times square root of 5 units. And here's our next step. Let's assume that alpha and beta are our two complementary angles. In other words, the sum of these uh, two angles, alpha plus beta, is going to be equal to 90 degrees. Let me go ahead and call this angle uh, alpha. We know this angle uh, is uh, 90 degrees. So therefore, uh, this angle is going to be our angle uh, beta. And now we know that this uh, whole angle is 90 degrees. This angle is beta. So therefore, uh, this angle has got to be alpha and now in this uh, triangle uh, this angle uh, is uh, 90 degrees so no wonder this angle has got to be beta so therefore we can see that these are uh, two right triangles the uh, triangle uh, ADC and this another right triangle uh, ADB are uh, similar triangles according to angle angle uh, similarity theorem so therefore we are going to have a uh, proportions in other words the ratio of uh, a, B and uh, A, C. Let me go ahead and write down the ratio of uh, A, B divided by A, C is going to be equal to the ratio of uh, A, D and uh, C, D. Let me write down uh, A, D divided by C, D. And now let's make an observation. We can see our uh, A, C length uh, is uh, 12 units. Our uh, AD length uh, is uh, 4 times uh, square root of 5 and finally CD length uh, is uh, 8. As you can see in this uh, next step I have replaced uh, all these uh, values. Let me go ahead and multiply both uh, sides by 12 to isolate uh, AB and here we can see 12 and 12 cancel each other out. Uh, so therefore our AB length is going to be equal to if we simplify the right hand side that is going to give us 6 times square root of 5 units. So thus after all the manipulation and calculations our AB length turns out to be 6 times square root of 5 units and this could also be written as approximately equal to 13.42 units. And that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.